So what we're doing now is this is part two of the dresser redo. We had his mother's dresser from when she was a young girl and I finished the main part of the dresser. I am now working on the drawers. I've already sanded them with my sander. I started out with a really coarse grit and I can't remember now but I think I started off with 60. I went up and then I ended up finishing the drawers with a 400 grit sandpaper because they had a lot of imperfections in them. Quickly talk about rollers. There are two style rollers that I have um, here at the house and let me just sit these down so that way I think the camera can better look at them. So this one here does not have, it's just smooth when you feel it. And this one here is what they call nap. Um, it looks like a sheep, right? Real fuzzy, real soft. This one is going to hold more paint. If you have a rough surface, you're going to want to use a nappy roller. This is the style they use more on like a popcorn or textured ceiling would be one that has, you know, kind of a nap to it. And hopefully that is... There, that's pretty good, isn't it? So what I like for these is this roller here, and this is just literally smooth when you feel like it. No, almost no, there's no texture whatsoever. It's just literally smooth. Is that better? So, this would be what you call more of a finishing roller. Where it doesn't have any type of texture, doesn't hold a lot of, a lot of paint, that type of thing.